Bioswill is a meandering creek-like uh, landscape where we took out the native clay soils and replaced it with a high infiltration uh, sandy and compost soil. And then we also uh, revegetated the area with uh, riparian plants, so river and creek plants. And the idea here is that the, infiltration so the high infiltration soil will allow for, um, for the, storm, the peak storm flows to infiltrate into the ground more quickly, thus reducing the flood. Uh, and we selected the riparian plants uh, so that they could take up and break down a lot of the contaminants that are present in the water. And lastly, the, the bacteria in the soil can actually break down a lot of the organic pollutants that are uh, in the storm water as well. So this is a natural solution to a, an environmental problem that uh, leads to uh, improved water quality in the immediate surroundings and ultimately San Francisco Bay. Uh, so a major part of the work that we do is public outreach, education, and community involvement. So beyond the uh, environmental goals that we have with the Bioswell Project, we also have community goals as well. Um, today we have, working with us, a group from the National Park Service. Uh, it's a group of high school kids and uh, students that are also like between uh, high school and college. And they're helping today to build a trail on the, adjacent, the space adjacent to the bioswale, um, where we're going to do uh, we're going to be planting uh, native plants again, and using it as kind of a transitional landscape uh, between our bioswale project and Berryland to give the entire space between Sixth Street and Eighth Street a completely cohesive look.